Hi, this is BMA. Both lately and in the past, a lot of people have contacted me and asked me how to install modifications for Emergency 4. And I understand that if you're a new player and you don't know how this works, it can be quite a hard task and I would really love to help everybody. Uh, but it also takes a lot of time for me because I have to uh, ride with people and try to bug fix their problems. So I decided to do this video and try to explain how everything works and how you get set up. That means that if you are a regular Emergency 4 player, this video will have not will not have much value for you. Um, but if you are brand new and don't know exactly what you're doing, this is the video to watch. Okay, so first of all, you will have to go to some web page where you can download Emergency 4 modifications. Um, my example, I put up my own web page right here, but you can basically choose any. If you go into the download section, you will see a ton of different modifications. These are all the modifications that I have created and have released. Let's take an example here, air score modification. You can see that there are five different mirrors and basically the four first here is the exact same modification. There's no difference between them. Um, but then again, there are some differences. You can see that some of them are packed, some of them are unpacked, some of them use my own mirror, some of them use another mirror. Uh, and that's because that some people, when they download load from these first two mirrors, they get some kind of error when they try to unpack the, uh, the file. Therefore, I also uploaded it right here. But as a regular player, you can just use one of these first two. It's only if you get into trouble that you will need to use these two down here. Okay. So there are two different versions. There's the packed and the unpacked version. It's the same modification. There's the exact same things in it, but it's a different way to install it. I will get more into that later. But let's say we just download these two modifications right here. I will let them download and then I will get back to you. Okay, so now we downloaded both of them and we are ready to continue. First, I go into my download folder right here. Um, and you can see that I have the packed and the unpacked version. But we don't need uh, to focus on that right now. We need to find the game. And, and depending on what version of the game you have, you'll have to look different places. Let's say that you have 911 first responders. Download it via Steam. This is what you need to do. You go into the, the directory of uh, Steam. For me, it's on the D drive, program files, and Steam. And you come into something that looks like this. Uh, per default, uh, Steam is located on the C drive, and you might have to look for it there. But in my case, it's right here. You press Steam Apps, press Common, and you can see that the game is placed right here. You open it up, and this is the menu that you meet. Let's say that you have Emergency 4 instead, the original game. This time you go into uh, C, Programs, 16 Ton Entertainment, and then you choose your version. For me, I have Emergency 4 Deluxe. And if you look right here, you can see that it is basically the same folder. Uh, these are the important files. And now is where the differences between the packed and the unpacked version starts. If we go back into our folder right here, and we just start up off with the packed version. You open it up, and you can see that the version right here, an E4 mod, and you place it out on uh, in the folder. Now there are uh, two different ways to install this. You can either just double tap it and it will automatically choose your default installer and use that or you can go in here press the mod installer file install package find that package and double tap it now it will also install the modification this might take a while it can take a few seconds it can take a few minutes depending on your computer and the size of the modification okay so now the modification is installed on my computer. Now the real problem starts if you have 911 first responders because some computers when you press this mod installer right here an error occurs. It says that the game is not installed correctly and you need to reinstall it. Even though you try that it doesn't work. And this is where the unpacked version comes into the picture. Because let's say we open this one instead. 
also drag that out into the folder and we will see there we go maybe okay now it's done okay and if we open this we can see that it's quite a different uh, setup um, but if we go into this folder right here, modifications, and find the mod, these are the exact same files. So what the packed version does, it actually just packs the version for you uh, and reduces the size of it, basically, and makes it easy to install. But let's say you can't do that. You press this folder right here, mods, and if you do not have this folder, you can just install it. And then you basically just take the modification right here, ASCO modification, and drag and drop it right in. This might take some time, but it will work. Okay, and now if we open it, you can see that we have the exact same setup on both, uh, both versions of the game. So let's say that we want to play this. You press uh, open the game. Uh, this is the same for all the different versions. The game starts up. And you end up in this main menu right here. Now you go into modifications. Choose the modification. Right here, ask our modification 1.0.1 and press OK. Now your screen freezes. This can be anywhere from 15 seconds to 5 minutes depending again on your computer and how big the modification is. Once that is complete, you will return to what looks like this main menu. And now you can just start it up just like any other learner game. You can just press free play and play it as a free play. And for some modifications, uh, like helping Peter um, or RTS mod, you have to play it as a campaign. But that depends from the modification to modification. Per default, always use free play unless something else is set. And that's how you do that. I hope uh, it helped you. I hope that you enjoyed it. And I hope to see you another time.